One, two, three, got tucked up. Four, Snoop Doggy. Nah, I'm just kidding. What's up with y'all, man? Y'all good out there? It's Friday. We out here shooting another episode of You Got the Juice, aka You Got That Juice Now, baby. How y'all doing, man? My name is Eric Kuto, aka The Juice Man. And today we're making a special version of my watermelon lemonade. You know what I'm talking about? I got some special things I want to show y'all. I got some friends over here. Can y'all see them? Can y'all see them? The pomegranates, the world's most expensive fruit next to dragon fruit. You understand? We got the pomegranates. We got the lemons. We got the watermelon. We got the beautiful blue agave. Man, you know what? We're not even going to spare too long. Let's get into it, man. Chopping up the lemons. Boom. You know what I'm talking about? And today I'm going to show you how to make watermelon lemonade, right? I got the, uh, the pomegranates, but what the pomegranates do is they pretty much regulate the heart, right? So you got some, some artery issues or you got some things going on in your arteries or you just need your heart cleansed, the pomegranate going to be examined for it. You know what I'm talking about? I had a lot of people in the comments saying that they actually juiced the whole lemon. And while I support you guys, um, I just don't like the taste of the whole lemon. I've been able to notice the taste of the entire lemon. And for me, that's, that's a no-no, not right now. Maybe I'll work my way up to it, but for the whole lemon, no sir. With the skin on it, it just, it gives it such a twang to it that I'm just like, nah, I can't do this right now. You feel me? Like I just, nah, that's not what I'm gonna do. But to each his own, for sure. Like if, if you do it with the uh, the skin on the lemon, nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Nothing wrong with that at all. That's why I tell you, it's, it's your juice. It's not mine. You're making, if you make this recipe, you still can tweak it to match your own. So you don't trip off of none of that. Boom. Yee. I told you how fickle them lemons is. Whenever you can't cut through a lemon, you gotta cut it down and shape it like that. So it's a little different, but no worries. But that's, oh Lord. See, it's so, so fickle. So fickle. I gotta get through to it. And Lord, I'm trying to put my finger all. Oh, you know, you're trying to get through and like all these cracks and crevices, man, it's just not easy. That's when I whip out that knife and I just slice. Cause it just, it, it can be fickle. These are the first lemons I think I finally got to be fickle on y'all. Cause I kept telling y'all the lemons were just, look, and we don't want that. So just gonna do some chop, chop, chop real quick. But that's it, man, boom. I've been seeing the comments. I've been seeing, so we got a thousand subscribers. Whoa, we got a thousand of them things, man. I appreciate y'all killing it. Y'all doing the damn, ooh. Wish I could kiss. I wish I could y'all a hug, you know? We don't, don't know about the kissing thing, but I wish I could y'all a hug. <laughs> but nah, man, y'all been killing it, man. And I, I just, from the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate y'all. Because, you know, you don't have to watch me. You can watch anybody. And I appreciate that you like my energy. You like what I offer. I really want to help you get better to a better place. So, you know, that's the goal. But... If you entertain too, I love it because that makes you want to stay. So I thank you for the thousand subscribers, right? And it's more to come, right? We got more people to welcome on the journey. We got more family members to, you know, have here. But for the ones that we do have here, I'm appreciative. Even with, you know, whatever comments we get, if you just having a day and you want to, you know, make your little comment, that's cool. We're not tripping. I see some of y'all going hard for me. I appreciate that. Y'all cutting up. But yeah, man, real simple, real light. Boom, boom. And that's it. We just want to get through these limits quick. That's why, I, so for the pomegranate, right? That pomegranate right there, I made sure I went ahead and uh, de-seeded that for y'all quickly. Because if I would have did that on camera, that would have took a long time. So if you're dealing with pomegranates, pomegranates do take a very long time to peel. And I just want to make sure that y'all understand that. Like, them pomegranates take no joke. Take forever. <laughs> but in the long run, pomegranates are so worth it. If you drink pomegranate juice every day, there, there should be nothing wrong with, you know, how you move, your energy levels, none of that. Because that pomegranate is really one of the keys to life. Pomegranates are so beautiful. You know what I'm saying? So if you're dealing with that, get you a pomegranate, juice it up, put it in that beautiful one, that Nama J2 thing. You know what I'm talking That Nama, boy. Nama. Nama. We got a thousand subscribers, Nama. Talk to me about this sponsorship, Nama. I need some love. That boy want that check. Come on, Nama. Stop playing it. Stop, stop being bad and bougie. Cooking up belt with a little oozy. Check, man. Where y'all playing? But yeah, man, I hope you guys had a great uh, end to your weekend. Hope everything's going well for you. If it's not, I promise it's going to turn around just because I said so. And because you believe it's going to turn around, it's going to turn around. So don't trip off of nothing, man. Whatever you're going through, say a prayer. Dust yourself off and try again. You could get it right. Just try again. Try again. I hope Aaliyah don't get mad. I changed that lyric. I'm sorry, baby girl. 
But yeah, man, you just try again, that's all. Whenever things don't go the way you think they should go, it's a bigger plan at stake. So don't worry about it. Just dust yourself off, try again. Simple. Your boss tripping, you're supposed to enjoy your weekend, now you got your working, try it again. You hear me? You look, you look, boo boo, you look, poo poo, she tripping, he tripping. So dust yourself off and try it again, try it again. For real though, man. If you don't wanna think it all the way, you could be shot on the first day. What about the next day? Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, that Aaliyah, man. Rest in peace to Aaliyah. That Aaliyah used to go hard. Break it down, break it, break it down, break it, break it down. <laughs> Timberland used to go crazy, bro, I swear. But yeah, look at these lemons, man. So fickle. And since we have a certain amount of pomegranate and we still got a lot of watermelon. I'm just gonna chop these up real quick. Boom, boom. All right, so we got three big lemons and that's cool. Let's get ready to start putting some juice together. How about that? Y'all know we got my friend up in here, that ginger. I wanna lead with the pomegranates. I tried to be fast enough to catch it. I thought I was Superman for a second. Ugh. Let me grab that. Rinse that off, cause you know we sanitary. And boom, throw the pomegranates in there, the little rubies. Throw the lemon in there, pull some of that, pull some of that skin off. Some big old lemons, right? No. When life gives you lemons, you make lemonade, bro, I promise. Stop tripping off what life throws you. Life gonna throw you some curry balls for sure, just to see if you're on your square like that. But you all right, bro. Throw some bread, you know me, I like that bread fires. Throw some bread fires on. Call it a day, throw you some future on, call it a day. If you don't like that, throw some Luther Vandross on, some Jasmine Sullivan. Shout out Jasmine Sullivan, man. I heard about what's going on with her mama. We, we with you, sister, I'm sorry, you know. We, we with you, for real, like for real. But if you know, for the ladies, I know y'all love the Beehive, throw some Beyonce on, you know what I'm saying? Throw that J. Cole on, I love that J. Cole. Throw that J. Cole on, man. Look how quick we do that. Yeah. And this one is super pink, super, super pink, like the Starburst. So that lets me know we in for a ride. Boom. Boom. And for this recipe, I would definitely suggest more watermelon just so you can get a lot of good juice. And this one is going to be really, really watery and less flavorful. You can tell by the way that the color is. So as I juice it, it's going to be perfect for the lemonade because with it being not as flavorful, those uh, pomegranates are going to get in the way. So here we go. Boom. Mix that up down. See what we got going. Look at that juice. Ooh, you got that juice, baby. Yeah, my beautiful Nama J2. Never let me down. Mm. Let's get it in. Come on, let's see. Oh, it's a beautiful juice right now. Let's get it. Let's get it. So while we're juicing that, I think it's a great time to say that. Um, our book, You Got the Juice Now, is still doing well. It's still on sale right now. Yesterday's price, not today's price. Get it while you can, because it only ain't playing. But now, nah, get you a copy. I teach how to juice, the different levels of juicers for your price point, spirituality, recipes. All the recipes in the book are not on YouTube, so you get a whole different set of recipes. On top of that, it teaches you what fruit help with what. So if you're really looking for that information, it's there. Shout out to our nonprofit, musictothemind.org, for doing some really great things. And that's it, man. We, we juicing. We got it all going. You see, ooh, look at that. Boy, this lemonade about to be crazy. This lemonade about to be out of there. Out of there. If y'all from New Orleans, y'all know who used to say that. Maya, out of there. We grew up on that, man, for real. All right, let's just do a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Come on. Don't be shy, baby. I know you're on, you're on camera. Come on. Don't be shy. Come on. There you go, girl. There you go, girl. Yeah, I kind of feel a little jip with this watermelon. Let's talk about this seed, but there ain't really no much of watermelon in here, man. What's going on? What, what, what's going on? Just dump him in there. Yo. Yeah. Yo. Yeah. Finish him out. Let's check the phone real quick. Oh, we still good. That's a lot. Because <laughs> I've, been, uh, I've been definitely clearing my iPhone, but it still be stopping me. And I'll be like, bro, what's wrong? So. I'm glad that that's still moving. Juice is almost done. It made a lot of juice. That's the thing I love about watermelon. Watermelon makes a lot of juice. Pomegranate makes a lot of juice. Lemons do make a good amount of juice. So it's really dope that it's doing that. Let's get this popping. 
Mm. Yes, indeed, man. This is how you end the week right here. Some good lemonade. And guess what? To all my subscribers out there talking about mint this, mint that, you need to put some mint. I tried to get mint. And you know what happened? This happened right here. Bobby, what did I ask you for today? Well, look, my boy came in here and asked for the mint. Come on. We ain't had no mint. Come on. He came in here and asked for it. Where we at? He broke it down and told me that y'all been begging him for that goddamn mint. Come on. Y'all chill out. My boy gonna find that mint and he gonna make it work for y'all. Come on, Bobby. Hold up. Let me let me get the dab on camera so they know we just met you. Yeah. Yeah. Appreciate you, Bobby. Yes, sir. All hey, subscribe to my boy. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs> so, since y'all want to talk about mint, I tried. I really did try. But I love y'all, so it's all good. Don't even trip. We're going to get some mint since y'all want mint so bad. Y'all want mint so bad. <laughs> Come on, juice that last lemon so I can show these people the hidden part. You ain't trying to get that juice. Hey, bye. Let's pour it out. I'll let it rain, I'll clear it out. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup with a soda. Shout out to my New York people. That's for y'all. You know what it's about. From the boogie down Bronx, you know what it's about. Boom. But that's, that's really it, man. It's the last little watermelon. Boom. This one's gonna be a good one. I'm not sharing this one. I don't feel like sharing this one. I don't. Take this off. That fresh bottle of agave. I don't do that because I might mess it up. There we go. Boom. It's a good amount. You don't want you don't want to be too much with the agave, but you don't want to be too little. You want to put a good amount in because. It's almost like the sugar, but it's not the sugar, you know, for the Kool-Aid. You're, you're just giving it a certain just like, uh, distinct type of taste to where the lemonade comes together all the way, for real. Ooh, I'm excited for this one. I'm excited for this one. All right, let's see what the judges say. I'm waiting on some ice, man. Y'all know I told y'all a few times, get that ice, man. That ice ain't no joke. Ooh. All right, we got the ice. Smelling right. Here we go. That's pretty good. But we need a little bit more agave. I can taste it. Ooh, Lord. Are you back in? You see what I'm saying? This is a real video. We don't fake the funk. None of that. It's good, but I want more agave for sure. Now let's try. Much better. <laughs> Much better. That's him. That's him for sure. Much better. And that's what I'm saying. When y'all out there making y'all juice, don't be afraid, bro. Pour that stuff back in. And pour some more agave or put whatever you need to put more of. It's okay. Do not be ashamed. Other than that, thank you for watching my channel. You got the juice now, aka you got that juice, baby. My name is Eric Kuto, the juice man. Signing off. Enjoy your weekend. Peace.